Of age friends, we have come from Assam, Guwahati, yeah. yesterday. Yeah. So this is our first time traveling to Nagaland, and what better time than to travel during the Hornbill Festival? We are actually amazed. It's a very nice place to be, especially during this time, and we are actually amazed by the culture of Nagaland. We're really very really happy to be here. Would you want to come back? Yeah, definitely, definitely. We'll definitely come back. And how did you find the uh, prices of commodities here? Uh, since we haven't had uh, Naga food before, so uh, it's, uh, every food is an experience for us. Uh, regarding the price, I think it's a bit high, uh, but it's good we are having new experiences. Hi, I'm Simi Saikya. I'm from Guwahati and I had a really nice, amazing experience in Hornbill here. And right now I'm enjoying, as you can see, and it's a very beautiful place. And I'm here for the first time actually. I tried the local rice beer here and it's really amazing. And I had the food here as well. It's really nice, it's really tasty. And I had a really overall awesome experience in Hornville here. I got this beautiful, amazing earring from here and it's really nice. I'm feeling very confident wearing it. Uh, first of all, I'm from Assam, Guwahati. My name is Anamika. Um, I am into journalism, but uh, apart from this, it's very lovely experience being from Northeast and uh, being into in uh, the state of Nagaland and this awesome festival called Hornbill Festival. It's very uh, rich in color, rich in heritage, different tribes, and it's very authentic and uh, the food and uh, I have tried the local beer over here and you can see the beautiful earring I have got over here. And I believe, not much though sure about it, but I believe this uh, this is from the Angami tribe. And this perfectly looked beautiful on me, I feel like. <laughs> and uh, I think you should uh, come once uh, in Nagaland to explore this beautiful festival called uh, Hornbill Festival. And uh, definitely will gonna, you're gonna like it. Uh, so as because I'm from Northeast, I'm from Guwahati. So well, uh, whenever I'm traveling in uh, Northeast and in Nagaland, so you can find similar products, similar commodities over in Kohima or Dimapur. It's a bit a uh, little cheap from this particular area. And I think it's a bit expensive over here. Then again, the one more thing came, uh, uh, topic come over here because of the stalls and and all. And they have to give, I think, some amount of money and and all because of the stalls and so. So that's why uh, it get a uh, little bit expensive. But then also you will get the good quality of the products over here. And sometimes I feel like uh, the product you will get over here and you can't find those things in uh, normal market and all. So this is really worth it. My name is Pradeep. I'm from Haryana. Or uh, This is my third time in Nagaland. Or uh, second time in Hornbill Festival. Such a beautiful place. Uh, uh, this is my favorite place. In uh, I am a uh, traveler, or uh, almost I am traveling almost India. But uh, <laughs> Nagaland, my favorite place because they are a lot of uh, hospitality. So uh, because uh, Naga people so kind, the hospitality is so awesome, and uh, the culture, especially my favorite, the culture. So. I love Nagaland and uh, uh, <coughs> I am uh, Nagaland mein, uh, almost one month to travel in Nagaland. I am very happy to Nagaland is part of others. I am very happy to be in Nagaland. So please, Nagaland is a part of Nagaland. And the culture and 
मतलब आप यहाँ इंजॉय कीजिए यहाँ के लोग बहुत ही अच्छे हैं खूबसूरत हैं और काफ़ी अच्छा लगा मुझे यहाँ पर आकर थैंक यू सो मच थैंक यू नागलिन यहाँ का जैसे जैसे मैं ट्रैवल करता हूँ तो अदर पार्ट्स में भी मैं गया हूँ सो so, यहाँ का खाना थोड़ा सा डिफरेंट है बट प्राइस में मतलब ज़्यादा प्राइस नहीं है नॉर्मली ही है और खाना काफ़ी अच्छा है यहाँ का या श्योर सर मैं यहाँ पर दोबारा नहीं बार बार आना चाहूँगा और मुझे नागालैंड से प्यार हो गया है थैंक यू थैंक यू सो मच नागालैंड एंड जितने भी जो ये वीडियो देख रहे हैं नागालैंड कम ऑन वेलकम टू नागालैंड Hi, I'm Imsang from Dimapur, Nagaland. Uh, hi, I'm Roisan from Arunachal Pradesh. Experience, mm, traffic was horrible, but then other than that, I feel like it's worth it. Like, yeah, everything is like really beautiful, nice, and about the food prices that we're asking us about, I feel like they take a lot of time and effort to cook all of those and to present that to us. So I feel like it's reasonable. I don't think it's expensive or any sort of that. And it's your experience. And I really like how the cultural establishment here was made. Yeah. I mean, it, it really, like, you can feel it. Like, you know, the rich in culture and there's so much joy and people are really happy. So it's, it's a nice experience. Yeah. Can you also give us any suggestions that needs to be done? Suggestions? Mm. Traffic control. Yeah, traffic control. <laughs> would be like I feel like that's the only problem or else other than that everything, everything is, like, is really good. Really held up in the chair. Yesterday, today luckily we came by scooty. Yesterday we came by taxi, car taxi and took us around 3.30 minutes, 3 hour 30 minutes to reach from Cultural Hall to Kisama. So yeah, that was bad. But then other than that, everything is really good and was good. Okay, well, because you're from Arunachal, would you want to come back to the festival? Yeah, I think it was worth it. I mean, I would definitely want to come again. And, or like, I can tell my family or my friends to also come. So yeah. It's a nice experience. My name is Joseph Long. I'm from Texas. That's the United in the in United States. And I heard about it just my friends. I was roaming in Dimapur. My friends invite me up here. So um, one of the artists that was singing, uh, she is my friend. So that's why I came to see her perform. And it was it's interesting to see, you know, the different culture and tribes and things that you know that kind of thing. It's fun to learn about it. Yeah. And how do you, how did you find the food? The food is very interesting, if I'm going to be honest. It's not what I'm used to, but yeah, it, it was good. There's some things that I like, yeah. And the beverages? Yeah, they were good. It was all right, yeah. And um, what did you find interesting here? Mm, just the being very different, you know. It's um, not nothing like where I'm from. It's extremely different, like night and day. So that, that's very interesting to come to a new place. It's like a new world in a way. Yeah. So we've had the ambassador of uh, US to India and also the US consul this evening. Yes, so I've seen general, that. Yeah. So yeah. they also mentioned about how American or native tribes or resumes with the tribals here. Do you find any similarities? Yeah, yeah, there are similarities, especially the way y'all do the dances and things for like the harvest and stuff. They do the same thing there. Um, so, yeah, in that way, y'all are very similar. And then, yeah, there's a lot of similarities, like the, the way y'all dress and things. Not exactly, but they are similar with the feathers and things like that, yeah. Is this your first time here? Uh, to the Hornbill, yes. Um, but to Nagaland, no, it's like my third time, yeah. Yeah. Do you, do you wish to come again? Yeah, probably. Yeah, probably each year I think I'll come. Yeah. Do you have any suggestions that we can do to improve the festival overall? No, really just advertising. It was a long time before I realized what was happening. So if uh, advertising improved, I would get more. Yeah. What actually brought you to Nagaland? Um, 
In the beginning, uh, really I was 18 years old and I just wanted to travel. That was the first time I came here and I just kind of roamed through India, several different spots and I ended up in Dimapur. Yeah. Yeah, and then uh, I met my friend um, back then and so because of that we I contacted and we just, you know, we worked together sometimes. Yeah. <laughs>